to Shasta Public Library's Virtual Storytime. My name is Cindy, and it's time to say hello. Hello, how do you do? It's good to be with you. Hello, how do you do? It's good to be with you. Hello, how do you do? It's good to be with you. It's good to be, it's good to be with you. Yes, you. This is the dancing dinosaur, Daisy. She was never lazy. She pranced and she danced, and that's why her name was Daisy. Daisy also liked to eat a very sweet treat. Cupcakes and chocolate shake, cheesecakes and fresh new bakes. Four mistakes is all it takes. Now Daisy has a bellyache. Okay, today we will be reading I Really Want the Cake by Simon Phillip and Musha Gagati. There's a smell I can't ignore. It's wafting through the kitchen door. It's time for me to find out more. I think it might be cake. It's on the table sitting there. I cannot help but stop and stare. And now I'm really quite aware. I think I want that cake. The decoration's just so neat. That icing looks like such a treat. It smells so chocolatey and sweet. I really want the cake. I want it now, and though I'm small, I'm sure that I could eat it all. But Mom has written on a scroll, you must not eat the cake. I'd be a fool to disobey. To eat the cake is not okay. And maybe if I go away, I might forget the cake. I'm really trying to be strong. To eat it would be very wrong. I've wanted it for so long, I must forget the cake. That thought has made me rather glum, and all I want is one small crumb. My mom says no, but I say yum. I'm going back for the cake. It's still there waiting, nicely placed, for me to have one little taste. To leave it would be such a waste, I'll only lick the cake. Oh my, oh my, what a delight. Somehow the lick turned into a bite. I can't control my appetite. Just one more slice of cake. I know I've not been very wise, and what I've done I can't disguise. I might have to apologize because I ate the cake. Oh silly me, what have I done? I'll have to make another one. I guess it could be kind of fun. I've never baked a cake. I need some eggs. I'll start with six. I'm sure it'll be a tasty mix. There's nothing that I cannot fix. It's easy making cake. I'll whisk and beat and stir and shake until my arms begin to ache. Oh no, that wasn't meant to break. It's hard to make a cake. My gosh, the mess, it's everywhere. It's up the walls and in my hair. When mom sees this, she'll faint, I swear. It's chaos making cake. Hi, Mom. I've come here to confess. I'm sorry I caused you stress. And yes, I've made a lot of mess. But hey, I made you a cake. The end. Okay, readers, it is now time to say goodbye. Goodbye, readers. Goodbye, readers. Goodbye, readers. It's time to say goodbye.